Welcome. Let's take a look now at a risk event for us traders for the week starting Monday, the 9th of January, as we see the first full week of trade around the world. Joining us now from Daily FX and uh, Johannesburg Newsroom is Juan Venkates, who's uh, with us with uh, his thoughts on a trade to watch out for. Uh, Juan, it's good to be able to catch up with you. Happy New Year to you. Uh, what are your thoughts? Good afternoon, Jeremy, and thanks for having me. As you mentioned, next week's risk event uh, will be focused on the US CPI release. And the market I'll be looking at is the euro dollar currency pair. Just a bit of background leading up to the December inflation print. Both US core inflation and headline inflation have been on the decline from roughly late to mid 2022, respectively. And after the Fed's last hawkish statement, which was again reiterated in the recent December pharmacy minutes, another inflation decline could spark yet another dovish market reaction for the dollar. The core inflation figure, which is the Fed's preferred measure of inflation, and that measure excludes both food and energy from the calculation, has remained relatively elevated due to wage pressures. And we've seen those wage pressures soften in the recent NFP release. So I'll be interested to see whether that translates through to next week's statistic. On the technical side, I have the euro dollar daily chart up on screen and price action has been relatively choppy of recent, forming a consolidatory rectangle pattern, which I've highlighted in pink. So there's pretty much two options or scenarios that could come out of next week's inflation read. The first being a CPI beat, which could cement a 50 basis point rate hike in the Fed's February rate decision. And that could push euro dollar prices back below 105 and beyond while a miss could garner support from bulls and push euro dollar back up towards that 106.15 swing high and potentially up to the 107 psychological handle. Interesting. Thanks so much indeed, uh, Warren. And we're looking ahead to that number next Thursday, US CPI. Uh, and that is the euro dollar trade around the release.